Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. My name is Rafiq Shahmi, and I will be talking about the economic impact of the triple disaster to Japan. This is part two. Part one you can view on Bex Council Instagram page. Without further ado, let's go. The first impact of the triple disaster to the economy of Japan is that it had incurred way more losses than it should be. Hurricane Katrina, as an example, had incurred under around 161 billion yen losses, which is around 7% of the whole Japanese economy production. The triple disaster had um, incurred around 200 billion yen losses, which is around 10%, way more than Hurricane Katrina. The second impact of the triple disaster is that the nuclear industry of Japan had been closed down after the event of the disasters. Immediately, 11 of the nuclear reactor all across the country had been shut down. And then after that, because of the protests of the people, 42 of the reactors had been further shut down by the country. This had decreased the national electrical output of Japan by 40% because they had closed around 50 of the nuclear reactor in Japan. The third impact of the triple disaster The Bank of Japan had to pump liquid money into the economy by to keep the market stable. So, because of this, the debt of Japan had been twice its national production, which means they have more debt than what they can produce. And this is a major setback to the economy of Japan. Last point is, and the last impact to the economy of Japan, is that Japan only had been recovering from deflation and recession for 20 years. When the triple disaster hit Japan, it had been a major setback to the process of recovery. And Japan also deals with other problems, which is the increasing commodity prices and also the aging labor pool. And with all this problem of Japan, the triple disaster had been a major setback to process of recovery and also to the economy of Japan. So this is a very unfortunate event that happened to Japan. And that's all. Thank you.